tonight? Well, we're here in Bellini's in Newry tonight to launch our Westminster candidates, of which I'm very, very proud to be one. We've got um, a massive job ahead of us in terms of this election. There are huge challenges facing the electorate out there, not least Brexit and the impact that that's likely to have. So we've seen enough of this Tory government to make us very wary of what is going to happen in the future. It's really important that people maximise the vote, that they get out, that they get registered. Check if you're registered to vote, check to see if you're around, if you need a postal or proxy vote, contact your local office. Please help us to send a strong message, not just to London, but to Dublin and to Brussels, that we want to have our voices heard and we are putting a very strong team of people together to represent us at every level on those issues. Uh, there's a great buzz in the room, a great feeling of energy, uh, and that, that's been here with Sinn Féin uh, and their activist base ever since the historic Sambia uh, election in March, uh, and very much that message of standing for equality, of integrity and respect, you know, against Brexit, against the Tory agenda, and against the border, hard or soft in Ireland. Uh, our people were against it, and this is a chance now for people to stand up once again and to make history again. The Tories want to pull us out of Europe against the Democrats will of the people of the north of Ireland. So I'm asking people to come out, stand up on the 8th of June and elect an even bigger Sinn Féin team that will send a message, no to Brexit, no to Tory cuts and no to any border on the island of Ireland. It's great to be here tonight. I think that it clearly it shows that the people in Sinn Féin, all of our members, are up for fighting this campaign. They want to get out onto the doors. They want to get talking to people about what this election is about. We stand strong against Brexit. We stand strong against the Tory cuts and people are going to hear that message. We stand for equality, we stand for rights and we stand for Irish unity. So great to be here, it's been a tremendous event. Our campaign is officially launched. We'll be on the doorsteps over the coming weeks talking to people, making sure we're engaging with them about what this election is about. But people have an opportunity to come out on the 8th of June to send a very clear message to Theresa May and the British government. If they do not represent us, we will stand up for our rights. This election was called by the British Prime Minister in very narrow English conservative interests and motivations about Brexit and that we have to make a stand against that and for Irish unity and also the vote of the people here needs to be respected including by the DUP and the Ulster Unionist Party the people here voted to remain and it's interesting that uh, leadership of unionism is on exactly the same narrow English conservative agenda as Theresa May so people here on the border People in agri-food, people in agriculture, people in those other business sectors know that Brexit is going to devastate them. So this is a chance to rally all of those and to be for rights, for unity, for progress and to ensure that the Tories don't have their way.